My name is Gizmo Varias, and I'm a singer-songwriter. I've been making music since I was about 10 years old. I started with rumba and flamenco rhythms on the guitar, and uh, I slowly started recording music at home after school and um, I've been collecting instruments ever since. Uh, I'd go on travels and find percussion that I would really love and I would slowly started incorporating these instruments into my own music. Freedom for change. I wake up and I to music. <laughs> In a way it's just something that I've always done and it's something that has always helped me so it's, it's just been so fundamental for me to have it in my life that eventually um, after doing it for so long things start to occur. Day, freedom, freedom, freedom for change. I've just recently released my first album this year. So it's been a real journey of discovery. I'm currently working on my second album, which has more instruments. Um, I've expanded the sounds, so like marimbas, uh, steel pans. Uh, I'm using a lot more of the piano as well. So I was born in Spain and I moved to the UK when I was four years old and then I came back again to Spain when I was 10 and once again moved back to the UK when I was 14. I moved to London which is in terms of music I mean there's so much of it there's, there are so many artists there's so many great singers that it almost kind of it makes you find yourself and to really know who you are where you come from what you're about and because that's the only way that you can really stand for yourself because you know there are so many other people so um, you don't want to be like anyone else um, otherwise you know I just I just feel like if you're going to be yourself then that's that's the best way that you can stand out um, there's no one else like you I find sometimes the artist gets in the way of the music and um, it's more about making a discovery almost by accident than trying to create something. When you, you're actually just experimenting and trying to have fun with, with what you're doing, I find by doing that you almost allow the ideas to come to you rather than you try to find the ideas. The music has always been a way to just express who you are and I think we all have a lot to offer to the world and um, you know some people find a way to express themselves and luckily for me music has been one of those ways. For insane objectives. As soon as you kind of take away that barrier that usually there is between audience and performer I find that you become a lot more relaxed and comfortable so a lot of the time, the nervousness comes from thinking, oh, what will they think of me? In a way, you kind of just need to treat it as a friend. No, no more, no more. Now it's very interesting because I've started to see that um, other people are starting to connect to it. So it's not just my own journey with music is how other people connect to it as well so it's we've making a connection with other people now it's something that's giving a, a life of its own to the music so the music i make now it's not just for me anymore it's i think it has a larger purpose oh, oh, oh.